ideas on how you can use it uh, to boost your productivity. So cooking recipes, you can ask for that. Party ideas, emails, not only for subject lines, but maybe um, you got a very heavy email and you don't know how to answer it. So you can paste the email and say, please provide options on how I can reply to this email, marketing, uh, or you wanna promote something. Travel ideas, we already talked about the travel agent. For your resume, also you can improve it. And again, remember, whatever you don't want the world to know, don't, don't put it in chat GPT. Uh, translations, I already talked about it. Summaries, this one is really cool. You can actually put like a big, big piece of information. You can copy and paste it, and then you can tell it, please summarize the five key points, or please uh, organize this information into a more digestible way to read it, things like that. You could, it could also explain complex concepts. So you can say, explain quantum physics to a 10 year old or anything that you think is very, like you don't grasp the, the information. You can say, hey, can you please explain this in more simple terms? It could also give you business ideas. Uh, so if you're thinking about starting a business, say, hey, again, think about your role, your audience, your challenges please give me some business ideas that I can do in Chicago, in Canada, or online, or whatever it is. Entertainment ideas as well. So if, if you have a day off and you don't know what to do, you can, you can ask for suggestions. If you have children, and I know that with children, you have to entertain them a lot. So it can tell you stories, or it can give you ideas on, on how to entertain them. That's in the general, in the general, RAM, in the marketing RAM specifically, for social media, for email, for blogging, for website, for storytelling, for proposals, for creating timelines, even for images. So you can say, hey, I want to produce this type of, this is my campaign, this is the pain points, or this is the content that I have, can you please suggest what type of ideas I should use? Or for video scripts, for YouTube, YouTube titles, descriptions, or scripts on how the video should go, how a reel should go. Um, this is a chat bot, so it's mainly about conversation. So to produce content is a great way to produce content. Proofreading, as, as you know, English is not my first language, although I love to write. I know that sometimes I have typos, grammar er errors and things like that. So I will put my information there and say, please proofread this text. Uh, and we also talked about translations. Here is another uh, another person that that I want to promote uh, because I bought I bought his his course and I actually thought it was extremely eye opening for me about things for marketing specifically. Um, so about creating business plans, about doing research with competitors, helping with vision statements, prepping to pitch investors for hiring, creating job descriptions, things like that. Also for Facebook marketing, anything that has to do with advertising, attention grabbing, headers, things like that, it can help. Customer service, we talked about it. Uh, YouTube, we also, they, it could also help you generate ideas for videos or for improving your, your titles, descriptions, for text messaging and creating campaigns via text message. For email marketing, especially we have any salespeople creating sales emails, creating newsletters, even cold emails. For websites, it can help you come up or do research for domains available, how to improve your website. Again, I actually already tried this. I put like a link of a, of a landing page that I created recently and it couldn't read it. Uh, and then I was like, why this can't be read? And then that's how I found out that they only have scraped the internet up to 2021. So you can actually uh, give a link of something that has been prior to 2021, and you can go there and summarize information from, from the website. For building online funnels, creating, picking a pitch, uh, creating online funnel ideas, for a, any type of affiliating marketing, you can also use ChatGPT. For SEO, I know that SEO is a big task. It could also help you with that. LinkedIn, Twitter, TikTok, social media in general, podcasting. 
for questions too. So this is also a really good source when, whenever you maybe are putting together some type of event or you want to create a um, questions and answers section on, on your website or on your company, uh, ChatGPT can give you ideas on how to create that, the Q&A section.